Hey guys, welcome back to some more of The Quarry. I'm really looking forward to going back and playing this because I want to know if there's any way to avoid um, Dylan's bite. Because it seemed like shooting through the roof was just going to be a terrible idea. I was going to ask whose vial it might have been in that tree that both Dylan and Abby found. But now that I'm thinking about it, it was probably the, the cops from the beginning. Because like, remember he put a needle in Laura's neck? So I'm just gonna say that's his. I don't know what it is, but I'm assuming it's not good because it knocked her out. Also, how did Ryan not freak out when he saw that thing crawling around outside? How did he not be like, oh my God, there's something outside. And then Dylan found it and almost came in. I don't, I don't get him. And then when Dylan and Ryan found that bear trap, Dylan's like, something like that could really take your hands off. And then his hand is gone now. So was that foreshadowing? All right, enough talking, let's get started. Prayers by Night, Chapter 6. I'm so nervous for Jacob. <laughs> Emma! Jesus Christ. Jesus! Fuck! Oh, man. God, this night sucks ass. Jacob! Emma, is that you? Yeah, that's Emma. Oh my, look at his back. <laughs> look at his face. This is, oh my God. We haven't seen Jacob in a minute. And I kind of wish I picked that other card because I feel like that would have been useful information, but it's okay. We're gonna find one of the hunters. Hopefully we can avoid that bear trap. He's still wearing her bracelet. And hopefully there's another way to get out of here besides using that rotor arm in that car because that's out of the picture. I should have dove for it, but then Jacob wouldn't have this blood on his face, maybe. And I wonder how that would have worked out for Emma. Like, would, have, would, have, would they have been together while she was running away from that creature? Hmm. Hey, what's this? Just a view. Yeesh. I'm gonna fall off this. Please don't fall. So, where are we? That's the dock. So is this where Emma could have gone? Like, are we going to the treehouse? It doesn't look like the same path. This this man has no clothes. Is that like a waterfall over there? Oh, there's so many ways to go. Oh, hey. What is it? Footprint? Well, that bodes ill. Fucking hell. <laughs> Where are you going? I didn't finish looking. What was it? Footprint? It looks like it, but... Looks like a shoe print or something. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Our objective is to find Emma, but can't we just leave instead? That seems like a better idea. Emma's not even here anymore. But he doesn't know that. Check out over here. For more clues. A camera. Is it not on? Oh. Huh. Maybe there's something on here. Why don't you take the whole camera? Where'd you put that? <laughs> You're not wearing pants. <laughs> okay, so some of these cameras out here. All right. Anything else before we head down into the spookiness? I mean, he has blood on his face, right? So maybe he has a little bit of protection? I 
I really thought when Bobby was throwing that thing at that blood at Caitlyn that she was gonna catch it when I did the QT, but she just like moved out of the way of it and it didn't hit her. Hmm. So we know the lady is out here because she called Jacob's name. I forgot about that. So. Oh, justice card. Justice, an eye for an eye, not exactly in some cases, but cause and effect, actions and consequences. There's balance to everything and we all play a part in making sure the scales aren't tipped. All right. Cool. I thought I heard a noise. I wonder how things are going to work out for Nick because he's bitten and not amputated. So I don't know. He seemed to go pretty crazy on uh, Abby. He's like, D are you dumb? <laughs> I feel like she's starting not to like him anymore. Did I? Oh. Uh. Ah! Ah! Oh God, Emma! Ah, Jesus Christ! She is here. Ah. Hi. <laughs> oh my God, no way! Am I glad to see you? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! Ah! You left me back there, you asshole! Oh, God, Emma, come on! <laughs> yeah, I did leave her. Ah. Sorry. Oh, God. What the fuck is going on? Look, I don't know, okay? Some, like, bear attacked Nick and Abby back there. Yeah, me too, but it definitely was not a bear. What? Who? When? Why? Sorry, I'm just... I'm glad you're okay. Yeah, barely. I mean, the thing that attacked me at the treehouse was like... A dog boy. What? It was like what, Emma? Like, out of a horror movie. <laughs> okay, um... Well, it, it was probably just like a, a bear trying to defend itself, you oh, know? Oh, don't be a dick! You, you know it wasn't a fucking bear! No, you're right, you're right. And now we have these fucking the, the hunters running all over the place. So that's a fun new wrinkle. They did this to me. <laughs> that's a lot of blood. Yeah, well, it's not mine. Mm, got quite the funky bouquet. No offense. Um, okay. <laughs> that fucking thing bit me, dude. Really need Caitlyn to look at it. It bit her? I... Wait, it bit you? That little scratch? Oh. I, uh, could have sworn it was much bigger before. Oh, God. I thought it scratched her. Okay, we've got to get out of these woods. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> oh. Hostile. You know, Jacob, you don't have to be a dick about literally everything. Okay. No, sorry. Yeah, that was so Shh. mean. Okay, you know what? <laughs> you're right. Okay? You're right. I'm sorry. Oh, you're so annoying. Oh my god, can we please not do this right now? Okay, seriously? I literally came looking for you as soon as I heard there was something out here. Or things? Like plural? Wait, really? <sighs> Okay. Run! Run? We didn't. I. Hey, what's up? That one's different. Sorry? <laughs> if 
we hide, we're gonna have to do don't breathe, so. Oh god, I'm scared. Oh, hello. Ugh, so ugly. Go away. Okay, I'm running out of time. Please go. Please go. Okay. The fuck? Jacob, shut up. Go get in the water. Please don't get caught in that. Please don't. Please don't, please don't. Oh god. There's so many of them. <laughs> Jacob, please look where you're going. Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh, fuck! Oh, shit! Oh. 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 <laughs> Pry it open. I don't want to pull it free. Oh, fuck! Ah! 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 Shit! Ah! 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 God! Ah! Ah! Look, you could. <gasps> what? Why did he do that? I can't. This game. <laughs> This game. I didn't even get any chance to talk because it's just craziness. Caitlin. Dead person in the water. Who is that? We don't know her. Is she like one of those hunter dudes? I don't think so. Should we do something? Should we do something? What can we do? She's dead. Shouldn't we take her out of the water? I mean, with the body. That's Kaylee Hackett. <gasps> Mr. H's daughter? I thought she went home with her brother. Kaylee. Yeah. I thought so too. Poor Kaylee. Is he breathing weird? Nick. You smell so good. <laughs> Nick. Uh, should I do this? Ye. You all right there, bud? Maybe dial it back a bit, huh? Fuck off, Caitlin. No. Uh, you're weird, Nick. Nick, what do you- Don't bite her. I don't want to taste you. Uh, hey. Come here. Ugh, Nick, what the hell? Ugh, get off! Push him in the water. Ugh, watch out! I said get off! Should we help him? He's... Oh god, I don't know what to do. Maybe the blood's good. Why would I... Okay. I got him. <laughs> Should we have done that? What did I do? You stopped him from eating you. That's what you did. Don't touch I, him. I don't know. Let's get him in the pool house. Dry him off. Uh, you all shouldn't be alone with him. <laughs> oh my goodness. Abigail. Just try to rest. Just try to rest. I'm sorry. Move 
nothing so much. It's pretty clean from what I could tell. I mean, it's not bleeding. But you need to see a doctor. This night is going really bad. Look, this is all I've got left from the nurse's station. Ooh, fun. <laughs> you better hope uh, we find you some real help before they wear off. How many did you just take? Looks like he just we poured them all in his mouth. Record of everything that happens for the police. Sure. Yeah. Not these police. Dead girl in the pool needs some explaining, huh? <sighs> Easy, man. And like photos, whatever we can. I've got a funny feeling that the cops are not going to want to believe any of this crazy shit unless we've got some hard proof. From now on, if you got your phone and you see something, take a photo or a video or whatever. Yeah. You okay over there, Abby? Look, no. Why don't you look around and see if you can find anything to help make Nick more comfortable? <laughs> Nick Nack, I'm sorry. Here, that better? Thanks. Oh. Hey. He's so out of it. I feel so bad for them all. It just I just don't understand why they have a summer camp out here when you know. When you know these things are running around. It doesn't make any sense. Like, why would you continue? I know it's been a, it's since 1953 or whatever. And these things only got here, what, six years ago or something? But like, okay, shut it down. You have kids here. And these other people. It doesn't, like, come on. I don't, I don't get it. I wonder where Caleb is. Aw. Those are his friends. I know I'm supposed to look at stuff after, but a recent picture, a recent piece of camp history, a younger Ryan enjoying his time at camp with Chris Hackett's kids, Caleb and Kaylee. Oh, sad. Dang. Hmm. It's creepy in here. Okay, I can go further back. Oh, I can go so many ways. Tell me which way is the final way. <laughs> um, toilets. Let's check in the toilets first. Hmm. Nothing in that one. Okay. Anything in this one? Nope. Just darkness. Oh, there's toilets across, too. It's so dark back here. Ugh, can't see. Okay, this is the wall. Is that the toilet making noise? What's that sound? Is it raining? I don't know. Really? There's nothing in the toilets? Man. Okay. I wonder if I can talk to them. <sighs> also, Emma. So I thought Emma got like stabbed in the arm when I missed that QTE. But she said she got bit. But then she said it was bigger. She thought it was bigger before. Oh, I don't like this angle. Um, hello? This is a shower. Yeah, she said she thought it was bigger before, and... Um... So is it healing? Like, is she becoming a thing? Like, Nick? Ah, what is up? Stop doing this! <laughs> uh, I'm getting confused. Okay. There's a lot of showers. Oh! The moon! Get it! The moon, how poignant. Poignant, how do you say that word? Poignant, I forget. Tonight of all nights, to, har to harness your fear and anxiety and then turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might just save your life. Oh, an eye for an eye. Actions and consequences. Oh no, the moon. Ah, uh, the moon's looking a little bit better. But I'm wishing I, I'm wishing I picked this one. I always regret it, but whatever. Yay, the moon. 
Okay. And two more? Nothing. What even could be in here to make it more comfortable? Oh, there's something on the floor there. Okay. Toilets had nothing but the showers. Wait, did I get all the toilets? I think I did. Because there was another set on the other side. Oh! This place was so different like 12 hours ago. Yeah, it was. Who is that drawing of? The hag? Yo, something is not right with that boy. You think? Dude is real sick. Did you see how he freaked out in the water? There was blood. Yeah, he was like a... He was like a fish out of water. Right? Uh, sure. You don't want to wipe that blood off? You know, something was weird when I tried to clean his wounds, too. At the lodge. What do you mean? All of his clothes were bloody, but I couldn't find where he was bit, or scratched, or whatever. He just kept moving around, like he didn't want me to see how badly he was hurt. Huh. Mm, rabies? <laughs> He's not oh. frothing in the mouth. <sighs> I think Abby would beg to differ. Yeah. Hey, yeah, isn't aquaphobia a symptom of rabies? Hydrophobia, yeah. But I think it's more about <laughs> a fear of drinking, not just getting wet. This was like... Like my cat in the bathtub. <laughs> yeah. Stay away from him, Abby. He's gonna bite ya. Abby? Yeah? Can I ask you something? Of course. Can I take a bite out of you? <laughs> Do you like me? Oh, Nick. I don't want to be aggressive, but I don't really enjoy spending time. She might, because he's trying to eat her. But I don't want to be aggressive. Nick. Please, just tell me. I've really enjoyed spending time with you this summer. That's such a... Oh, such a... Such what? Uh, what? I've got something to ask you. Mm, you already asked me a question. Uh, yeah. Okay. What? Why don't you like me, Abby? Why are you so creepy? He used to be normal. You're different. You are different. Nick. You're different. No, no. Just Nick. Good old big dick Nick. What? What the hell? <sighs> okay, time to go. Leave him alone. I'm sick, Abby. Why don't you care about me? I do. I... I... You're not really very smart, are you? Poor stupid Abby. Alright. Don't make her cry. Easy pickings. <laughs> Easy picking. Oh, right off the bone. This isn't you. I mean, this this isn't you. I <gasps> Are you gonna bite her? <gasps> Whoa! Whoa, Abby! Oh my god. Abby, everything okay? Oh my god. Holy um, shit. Nick is an animal now. I think it's time to go. Oh, he's smiling. You're scary. Look at his eyes. What is that? Should I use it? Oh, are you serious? Hold on. <laughs> You're asking me to shoot him? Defend yourself. That's the goal. I think to shoot him is so Okay, I don't I hope this isn't like bad that I'm taking this time. But to shoot him is so drastic. But I have no way of knowing if there's any way for him to come back from this. And I'm sure Emma has the same fate now, like which I'm mad about. 
which is it's my fault um but i don't know if he can come back from this and shooting him is just gonna kill him right like that's the end of nick but i also everything's pointing to the fact that he's not gonna be able to come back from this and oh i'm just supposed to shoot him I mean, he did just, like, launch her against the lockers. I don't know what to do. I feel like I'm scared of the uncertainty of shooting him and not needing to. But I'm also scared that if I don't shoot him, he will kill Abby. (laughs) I don't know what to do. I think I might have to shoot him, but I'll try shooting him, like, in the leg or something. But maybe that's not going to be enough. Should I not shoot him? I don't know what to do. This is killing me. Um. I shot over there. Don't come get me now. Well, I should have shot him. Should have shot him. Pick it. Abby's dead. Oh, okay. Well, goodbye, Abby. Wow. Emma, I'm mad at myself. Well, I guess that was pretty stupid of me, right? I liked Abby. Emma, you're next. The fuck is Emma? Okay, so if I were a counselor at an off-season camp, partying around a bonfire, and it started to rain, and there were monsters, I would go to the lodge. So, it would have been smart to shoot Nick because... First of all, the objective was to defend yourself, not just shoot the gun to the left. Second of all, I knew that he was becoming that and I just... There's obviously no coming back from that. Um, So yeah, Abby's dead. And it probably, it would have been better because Nick was far gone anyway. There's no Nick coming back. So I should have just not worried about him and saved Abby. But, you know, I'm sad. (laughs) I was really trying to keep them all alive. But uh, I guess it's fine. Nothing I can do. So let's just go back. I wonder if that devil card would have showed me that I should have done that. I mean, Jacob just got knocked out looking at that hermit card. I don't know if there's going to be, I'm sure there's going to be more to that. What's that? Oh, beer. Beer and watermelons. How's her phone still working after all that? She's landed in the water. Well, I don't know how she got her phone back. How'd she get her phone back from being in the lake? Because she went to the other side of the lake. 
I don't know. Aww. What's this? Brian's stories again. Brian's stories? I had no idea kids were getting oh. freaked out about this stuff. We officially suck as counselors. Hi, Mom. Camp is so fun. Mr. Hackett's teaching us so much about nature and being safe in the woods. My friend Josh said he saw a ghost. I think he's lying just to scare me, but I drew a picture of her anyway. That was the thing we ab found, Abby found in the pool house, I think. She looks quite angry, but I, but I think sometimes when people are angry, they're just sad instead. Oh, I guess she is sad about her son. If that's her. We're going sailing on the lake tomorrow. <laughs> I can't wait. Love from Rowan. Poor Rowan. Poor Rowan got spooked. I can't go inside. Ugh. Alright, well if it comes down to it, we know Emma needs to be taken care of. Because Caitlin said she couldn't find where Dylan was- not Dylan, Nick was bit. So, and Emma's saying- well, Jacob's saying that she he couldn't find Emma's bite. crazy that it's just down to QTEs. I don't know. Maybe before if we didn't ask, if we didn't call for Nick back in the woods with Nick and Abby, maybe that thing wouldn't have gotten to us, but I don't know. I'm just speculating. But maybe some things are supposed to happen. Oh, well, ugh, you know, I'm so tired of this. Gotta get out of here. I just want a break. I just want a break. I, I missed the beginning. I know I was saying I want there to be more action, but now I'm- <laughs> I miss just playing truth or dare. Chilling by the campfire. She's- oh, I was gonna say she still doesn't know about the creatures, but she definitely does. <sighs> Rain must have done this. <sighs> so there's no book going back that way. Where did Jacob go? Or rather, what's he doing? Okay, I'm going that way. Aww. Nick really just burst out of his skin. The new Nick. I want to know more. I need the science. I need the history of what's happening. I need to know the process. And I need to know why Mr. Hackett doesn't care about anybody. Because they should have just shot, shoot, what? Shut this place down. Imminent danger. Hmm. Okay, do we have two ways to go or is this path blocked? I think I can go that way, but maybe I should go up. And if I can come back, I will. Hmm. This seems pretty final. I don't think if it... It meets back up with the other path. Let me go down there real quick. Just to check it out. So, since it already bit her, I wonder if it's gonna still be interested in doing something else. Hmm. What was that? phone's got to be low battery if she's using the flashlight this much. I wonder if it's going to run out. That would suck.
Oh, the paths do meet up. Okay, cool. But is there... Oh, hey! What is that? A noose? Nothing to say about it? Just gonna look at it? It's tiny. It looks that way anyway. Why is she say why is she not saying anything? Alright, the other way is just back down the stairs, so that path doesn't go any further, so we're gonna keep going this way. Dylan was right when he said <laughs> He was like, we need to amputate. The only reason I didn't want to do that is because we don't we don't have any I don't even know if we could do it. But we didn't have the proper tools for that. I mean apparently a shotgun works just fine, but <laughs> Okay, there's a path down this way too. But I just saw the lodge back there. This place is a lot harder to navigate at night. <sighs> what? They did this to us. Who did what to you? Okay, not going that way. <laughs> I mean, maybe we could go back, but it's probably stupid. Hmm. I wonder if there was- there's probably more clues to find in the beginning, right? <gasps> oh, I don't like that. Ugh, please. Is that Nick? You know There's another one. Come on! I've never done this before, Pop. Let's do it fast. Oh, that's his dad? I don't want to run. Should I? Damn these <laughs> fucking kids. Follow so, them. Ah! Ah! Hey, stop. Stop squirming. Give me the try. Is she bit? Huh? How am I supposed to know? I don't know. Let me look at her. Nah. Well, she is bit, but you Get just- Get the fuck away from me! Oh. Maybe you shouldn't kick people. It's Jedediah? I don't... No, no, no. Follow them, follow them, follow them. Emma. Hey, 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 hey. Caitlin! Huh? Ryan! Abby! This doesn't feel safe. Shut up, Emma. Ryan? It's not like she doesn't know those things are out there, so I don't know why she's being so loud. Close the door. Is there someone in here? No. What'd they do with Jacob? Ryan. Ugh. 
Not back to this. No. Why, Look, why would we, we just gotta focus? We, we can still get out of this alive together, okay? Well, not all of us. Oh, right, Dylan, shut up. Yeah, no shit. Dumbass. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Who is that? Hey! Oh, shit. Where the fuck is Chris Hackett? Hey, it's Laura. Who is it? Who's there? I need your help. Please. Who are you? Let's My just name is Laura Kearney. So? <laughs> so let me in. It's not safe out here. Let uh, her in. Yeah, there's a crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit. You, Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yes. You were supposed to be working... Uh, Helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you never showed up. Uh, you and the guy, what's his name? Max. Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. He liar. I, I think that we should. I think that we should listen to her. Yeah. Inside. Let her in. No, come on. Let's let her in. Okay. I'm gonna open the door slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? Okay. What happened to you, baby girl? <laughs> oh, oh, it's over. Hi, lady. Here we are again. Here Test. we are. You and me. And the bird. Why don't we take another look at what you've found? Sure. Justice. An eye for an eye. Not exactly in some cases, but cause and effect. Actions and consequences. There's a balance to everything, and we all play a part in making sure the scales aren't tipped. The moon. How poignant. Poignant. Tonight of all nights, to harness your fear and anxiety and turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might just save your life. Now tell me, would you like to delve deeper into one of many possible futures? Sure. Make your choice. Okay, so they both seem good. I think I'm gonna pick the moon just because she said it might save your life and I wanna know what could possibly save my life. I don't wanna lose any more people, so let's try the moon. Laura, maybe? And the cop? And maybe somebody else getting locked up? The cop, maybe? Off you go then, top top. One down, remember. It's not terribly exciting. Don't say one down. Don't like that. Okay, well, let's check out some tarot. Oh, let's just watch this one again. Okay, Laura opening a locker, finding a needle. She stabs the cop. Takes the keys and locks him up. Now, is that a good thing to do or is that a bad thing? I wonder if he cut out her eye. Okay, if if it's gone. All right, let's do that then. Maybe we'll just do it. Oh, Abby's gone. I have to replay this. I need to save everybody. 
Laura's there. I wonder if she's gonna tell us what happened to Max. I wanna know everything she knows. Everything. <sighs> okay, evidence. Memory card. The memory card from a broken and dirty camera lost in the woods. I hope we can look at that. Clues. Kaylee's dead. However happy they once were, that's all changed now. I wonder if he's actually gonna come to his senses now that his daughter died and be like, oh, maybe we shouldn't have this anymore. This collar. If they were keeping one of those things, why would you give it a collar? And why would you keep it alive? That doesn't make any sense. Okay, I didn't read this last time. Though this is a novelty signpost, it also acts as a chilling reminder that Hackett's quarry really is a long way from anywhere. All right, kids, letter home. The camper that wrote this must have changed, must have had a change of heart and decided not to send this letter home. Ghost stories are only stories after all. All right, I wanna click on it. The letter matches up to the drawing in the pool house, but why was it torn up? Maybe there was something to this ghost story. Oh, that's creepy. Among the, miscellane among the miscellany of the these forgotten belongings is a scribbled drawing of a woman in the woods. The ghost stories seem to have really left a mark. This drawing matches the letter found at the fire pit. Kids have the scariest imaginations. Aw, Rag Guy and his friends. Okay, paths. Okay, Emma found nothing of use. Was I supposed to find something? Maybe the gun? I don't know. Without the fireworks, Emma was left defenseless against the hunters in the woods. I mean, they didn't really do anything to her. Aww. My fault, Abby. <laughs> Next time, I'll be sure to shoot him. Oh, Jacob was captured. Poor Jacob. At least, Di at least Dylan saved. Okay. All right. Next time, we're gonna hear what Laura has to say. I'm excited. I need to know. I need to know everything. So we'll have to wait until the next part for that, and I'll see you then. Bye.